Exercise 14A, question number 14. We have done uh, up to question 12 before and question 13 was the homework. Now, question 14 says state whether each of the following statement is true or false. <coughs> if it is false, explain why. Question number 14, part 1. It is described earlier that every member, every member is of set is called element. This is the element. So, 2, 3, 4, 5. Suppose these are the number within the set. So, they are the element element or member member of set suppose it is set a so these are the element or member of set a set a and this is the notation of belongs to or the member of or element element of any one so if i say 2 is a member of set a so it is true because Two is a member of set A. Similarly, if I say um, five, if I say five is a member of member of A, or I write five is a member of just write the set two, three, four, five. So yes, it is true because this 5 is belong to this set. Similarly, if I say 6 is a member of A and I have to describe it as it is true or false. So, 6 is not mentioned here. So, 6 is not a member of set A or if it is written as 6 is a member of 2, 3, 4, 5. So, it is false because 6 is not a member of this set but if it is written as 6 is not a member of A and set is described as 2, 3, 4, 5 so it is true because 6 is not a member of A and 6 is not mentioned here as well so it is true 6 is not a member of set A now we come to the questions of our uh, textbook. Question 14 says, state whether each of the following statement is true or false. If it is false, explain why. These are the statements. So, in part 1, it is say C is not a member of set C A R. So, C is mentioned here. So, we write, we write, it is true. It is false, basically. Why it is false? because C does not belong to C A R the set the set have a member C and it says C is not a member of C so it is false or wrong so part 1 is false because C is a member of set and it is according to a statement C is not a member of this set so it is false in part 2 it said car is a member of C A R. C A R R individual character or individual letter of set and car is a word. So, it is not a member of this set. So, it is also false. If it were C is a member of this, so this was a statement, it, it would be correct. If, if, if it were written, if it were written C is a member of C A R. So we, we write true because C is a member of this set. But it is written that C is not a member of C A R. But C is a member of this set. And it says this statement says C is not a member of this. So it is false. Now come to question 3. In part 3, it says set a set c not a, not not individual c but set c is a member of c a r so c so it is false because only c is a member of the set not the set complete set c so it is false 
in part 4 c a r is equal to 3 no these are this is this, this cannot be equal so it is false these are the set and these are the numbers so they are two different thing similarly in part 5 5 is a member of set 1 3 5 7 so it is true because 5 is a member of 1 5 is a member of this set and 6 parts is 4 is a member of set 1 3 5 7 so 4 is not mentioned here so it is false not in part 7 it said bus is a member of b u s so it is also false as it described here in part 2 and in part 8 it says b is a member of letter b u s so it is true because b is a character or the letter and it is it is also mentioned here as an element so it is true